Hi everybody, I'm Amy, and this is Date Aid, where I fix all of your existential dating dilemmas, or at least try. This week I heard from Jocelyn, and she wrote, Hi Amy, I was chatting with a guy online and he asked me for a drink. I said yes, I gave him my number, then nada for two months. Last week he wrote me and he was like, I'm sorry, I started seeing someone else and it didn't work out, but I liked talking to you and thought I'd reach out again. At first I was like, fuck this guy, but then I was like, wow, honesty and directness, that's nice. Should I give him a shot? At my last job, the owners of the company hired this feng shui consultant to come in and bless our office or something. We didn't know, we were never really sure why because the whole thing seemed pretty pointless. She was this British woman with long grey hair who always wore a bowler hat with eagle feathers. And her job, as we understood it, was to just walk through the office and stand in particular areas and just feel the energy. This went on for months, and then one day she walked through a hallway and she shouted, Stop! This area has rhythm! And that was pretty much the extent of her services. In the end, we decided that the Feng Shui consultant was an overpaid charlatan. Online dating, like feng shui consulting, can sometimes seem kind of pointless. You never know if you'll have chemistry with a person until you meet them in person, and that's why you need to physically sit next to that guy and have a cup of coffee or a cocktail before you truly decide if you want to give him a shot. Be skeptical, he may be a charlatan, but you owe it to yourself to see if you two have rhythm, or whatever. Good luck! For all your dating dilemmas, email me at dateaid at thefrisky.com or tweet at thefrisky and use the hashtag dateaid. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and come back next week for more dating advice.